Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another Grand Photo 5 Mods video. Today we'll be playing as firefighters with the United States Forest Service. Our job is to protect, prevent, and suppress any fires that may pop up here in the Polito Bay National Forest. We're currently located on top of Mount Chiliad, which gives us a perfect view of the whole forest. And we're going to be using this fire watch tower to make sure there are no fires burning. And in case there is a fire, we will be quick to respond with our fire trucks so i really do hope you guys enjoy this video thank you so much for watching and let's go ahead and get this video started we are currently on top of mount chiliad guys we have pumper number 350 which is like a mini engine over here and then we also have rescue 35 both of these trucks are in service today to help protect the Polito Bay Forest now on this truck we have a bunch of rescue equipment and extrication equipment as you guys can see right here and then on this truck over here which is going to be our engine we have fire suppression stuff uh, such as hoses and water right over there so we we are prepared for just about anything and of course if anything does pop off we will request backup and we'll get some bigger type 3 engines and more equipment and personnel out here but in the meantime let's take a look at this fire watch tower this thing is very cool let's go to the top of it oh look at that plane right there now you guys may notice there is not one cloud in the sky today guys yeah it is very dry and that's why we got to be out here and keep our eyes open for any potential fires that may start. But we have a great view up here, though. We can see sandy shores. We can see a little bit of Los Santos. And then here we have the forest. And uh, we can't really see Polito Bay, but Polito Bay is right over there. So we're out here, guys. We're doing what we're doing. Let's take a look at the inside. Ooh. It's pretty cool. We got some equipment in here, shovels, bags, sleeping bag. We got a heater. Very, very cool. First aid kit. Nice, nice. So that's a mod by PW Parks fan. Still in beta, but if you guys want to check it out by joining the Parks Benefactor program, I'll definitely link it down below for you guys. And uh, yeah, let's see what we get into. All right, we got to go. That thing is spreading fast. We're going to be the first units on scene. We're going to see if we can make a stop on this fire before it gets completely out of control. Oh, we gotta be careful here, guys. This road is treacherous. <laughs> oh! I know he wasn't gonna make that turn. Alright, that thing is starting to spread fast. It looks like it already jumped across the road. This is like the hardest road I ever had to drive on to respond to a call. This is crazy. What was I thinking coming up here? Alright, it says we can also call in a water bomber if we have to.
Alright, we are on scene. Let's get to work. We're gonna start with a attack line first. Alright, let's start with a attack line. Let me see if I can just start pushing this fire back a little bit. I don't want it to jump across the road. Now we are gonna need a bigger engine because we're gonna deplete our water supply very quickly here. Alright, we're gonna need a another unit here, so let's get a another engine to back us up. Alright, we're about to be out of water, so we're gonna go to our backup plan now. Oh, perfect. The Type 3 engine is here. Alright, so we have a little bit more water. Before we start using that, though, let's work on cutting a fire line. Alright, so we have our backpack on, we have our hoe, and let's get to work. We also have more units on scene trying to spray water and suppress the fire, so since they have that side kind of working well, let's work on this side of the fire. Let's see if we could just get this to stop spreading. Oh, it is spreading far away. I'm going to work on this side and make my way back towards the engine. Yeah, this thing is burning good right now. This side is really intense. We're gonna have to stretch a line over here, guys. Alright, so we have multiple engines on top. Any other engines coming into the scene, to the Polito Bay scene? I need you guys on the lower level of the hill, lower level of the hill. That's going to be the west side. We're going to need more fire trucks to the west side. Okay, perfect. We got two more engines over on this side. I think we're going to be able to control this, guys. We're about 10% contained. But as long as we stop it for spreading, I think we're going to be okay. Hey, Panos. Um, I just thought of something, too, by the way. Um, if you're watching this video, what do you think if you, like, add some add-on trees, like some object trees to the area of the fires and then we can cut the trees with the chainsaw to kind of like help stop the fire from spreading. I think that would be really cool. That would probably be a cool idea. Let me know what you guys think about that. And by the way, I do want to give a huge shout out to Panos for making this call out. By the way, this is fire call outs we are using. And you guys can find this link down below in the video description. I have two links, one for the LSPDFR version, which is a public version. I am using the beta version, though, so the beta version you can find on Patreon. It just has a couple bonus features. Not really bonus, I should say work in progress features, um, like the hose. So the hose is still in testing, I know. It 
it's, it looks a little weird, but honestly, in my opinion, it is great because it functions, and for the most part, that is all that matters. Like, having a functioning hose in this game is awesome. I love it. So, if you guys want to check that out, check out the Patreon version or check out the uh, regular public version on lspdfr.com. But, uh, yeah, we're making a good attack on this fire, guys. I'm gonna go grab a line again. And let's see if we can put out the rest of this with a fire line. Let me just get this little piece out right here. There we go, that one was a little bit stubborn. Alright, well, uh, we're kind of not working safely. I'm like in the middle of two different fires, so let me back out of here. I don't even know where my team is at. Let me back out, let's grab a line, and then we'll come back in and try to spray water on the fire. Oh man, oh my goodness. This must be a spawn point for these because these things kept spawning right here. That's like four or five of them.
And I think we have more than 50% of the fire contained at this point. So I think we're not going to need air support. I think we're going to be able to get it out with just the ground units we have. If winds shift or anything like that and it starts spreading, we will call for air support though. Alright, yeah, this thing's looking at about maybe 80% contained at this point. Alright, so let's go back and get our hole again. Oh, we got fire up there too, guys. Alright, we gotta run up there and try to put out that fire. Alright, let me knock out the rest of this so that we could get the fire up there. Okay, fire appears to be out. The main body of fire appears to be out over here. We did have a secondary fire just to the south of us, so let's head up there and try to extinguish that. Alright, so let's relocate our units. gonna do we already have a type 3 engine over here kind of holding back this fire so we are going to go ahead and get our hand tools again and let's go there's a small bit of fire up there let's go get that fire up there It did not look like a lot of fire from down there, but it is a lot of fire. <laughs> I think we'll be able to knock it out, though. These hand tools are pretty effective at cutting fire lines. And in this case, I know it's like not actual fire line. We're just really just putting out the fire with it, but yeah, works well. Feel free to help out guys, you guys have hand tools as well. Go ahead and grab one and uh, start hitting. <laughs> That's the thing with single player, I gotta do everything myself, but it's all good. I, I really like this call, I hope you guys enjoy it as well. 
And the fun thing about it, I know this is the same call we did last time when we were playing as Cal Fire, but the fires spawn differently each time. It is random. And there are also other fires around the map, so I know we did this one two times, but we'll also respond to some of the other brush and wildfires all around San Andreas. So if you guys enjoyed this video, definitely make sure you subscribe and look out for future firefighting mod videos. Oops. All right, last bit over here. Now we just gotta run back to the engine, and I think we are done, guys. I feel like we should take the Type 3. Let's get a Type 3 and put out the rest of the fire with a Type 3 engine. So this pack I'm using for the skins, the wildfire skins. I, want, I think this one actually looks better. This one is like a darker one. The other one was a little bit lighter. Let me know which one you guys think looks better. Now that I look at the darker one. I think this one may have been a little bit better. I probably should have used this one for the video, but it's okay. I think it still will come out okay. Alright, I say we are at about 99% guys. We almost have this thing completely knocked down. Code 
All right, guys, so that is going to do it for today's episode. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really do hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you go ahead and smash that like button. Leave some comments down below. Subscribe if you are new. Also, hit that notification bell so you can be notified whenever I post a new video. And let me know, guys, what did you think of the video? Also, if you want to download any of the mods, they will be linked down below in the video description. I have a link to my website, acepilot2k7.com and that mod list has everything we use so we have the fire skins these mount chili at fire department skins we have the uniforms by nova which are awesome he sent me another one um so we used cal fire last time today we have the uh forest fire version which is awesome and then we also have all of the other equipment uh the fire call outs everything that we use is down below on my website and um yeah thank you so much for watching and i will see you guys in the next one peace Oh! Oh no no stop drop and roll! Stop drop and roll!